In 1847, the St. George Brewery, where I now sit, was completed. The design and construction were so innovative that the Illustrated London News ran along a detailed feature on the architecture and the brewing process. The beer was made vertically, starting on the third floor, with raw materials stored in the attic above. This vertical process meant that the upper stories bore enormous weight, so our floors are uniquely designed, heavily reinforced, and listed by English heritage. They're supported by enormous cast iron pillars. The ones in the basement are so stumpy that they look as if they've been squashed by the sheer weight of beer above them. But, sweetly typical of the time this, they all have classical capitals, as if we were in some industrial Parthenon. <laughs>